Rihanna here for HRH TV, and I'm with Ben and Piers from Evile. How are we? I'm all right, thank you very much. Evile, I feel like I really need to Evile that kind of. <laughs> So you're at the uh, first HRH metal. Are you excited to be here? Yes, very much so. Yeah, yeah. You're on, you've got quite a, a decent slot tonight as yes, well. Very good. Yeah, it's perfect for us. Perfect for you. Yeah, perfect <laughs> yeah. for us. Um, and you've travelled quite a way. Literally just rolled into the building and come yeah, into the. Yeah, literally got here uh, five minutes ago. <laughs> still freezing cold still from the van. Yeah, but <laughs> yeah. that's how we roll. That's rock and roll for you. All the time. Um, so how's how's 2017 been treating you so far? Very quiet for us. Yeah. yeah to tell you the truth, we're currently writing our new album, mm. album number five. Mm. As yet untitled, got yeah, a few ideas in the works. The last one on. was Skull, it was am I Skull, right? Yes. yes, that was 2013. It so was we've, indeed. We've got had a few years. Have you, how long have you been writing for? Um, it's, it's always constant for us. Yeah. Um, we kind of set a start date in our heads mentally, but we never kind of stick to that. So it's just a rolling, ongoing thing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And what do you both do in the band? Just uh, for everybody that doesn't know. Lead guitar. <laughs> lead guitar. I hit things. Oh, you're a hitter. I'm the hittest. The hittest. Yeah. The hittest. I like that. I think I prefer that to drum mist. Yeah, not drumming, because that implies there's some skill involved. <laughs> <laughs> Just make noise. Um, what's coming up for you in 2017, then? Um, um, we are concentrating on writing. Yeah. That's what we're doing. We've got a little festival that we're playing in Spain uh, in early March. Mm. March um, 12th. Oh, yeah, good March memory. 12th. Good. Um, and I think after that, that is when we're going to really, really start attacking it and making it a priority. Yeah, sort yeah. of hide yourselves away somewhere. Definitely, and yeah, go into hermit mode and get writing. It's the best way yeah, to do it, yeah. yeah. A, a release next year, I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah. aiming for next year. Yeah, definitely. Okay, fair we're enough. In, we're in no rush as yet. We haven't got a label behind us. Yeah. Um, we're all working day jobs still and that kind of thing. And so it's got to fit yeah, around that. But I think, I think this year is the, the kind of turning point again change gear and go forward with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. makes sense. You've done a lot of um, lot of European gigs and stuff quite recent. Well, not recently, but over the time. Yeah. What sort of... A lot of bands struggle to get sort of out there. What do you think has been different for you in terms of being able to get to, to Europe and get that base over there as well? Um, we, we've always had a good base in Europe. Yeah. Um, it, we've, we've done run the mainland Europe. We've gone up in Scandinavia quite a lot. Um, for us, the longevity is still within the band, but the, the gigs have to be there to do that. And we're all a bit older. We've all got bills to pay, that kind of thing. And we're not—we haven't got the luxury like we used to have of being able to drop everything and go on tour for weeks on end. Yeah. That being said, as well, we we're quite niche as a band because we don't really have a lot of bands we can tour with. Mm, yeah. You know that yeah. we've got that limitation as well. Yeah. You with was it Sepultura a couple of years ago? Yeah. yeah. Right, 2015. Yeah. Remember? Like, yeah, I know. It's, it's like, like oh my god, we're 2017. Like yeah, it's yeah. that far. That's that long ago, isn't it? How was that for you? Was that a good it tour? Is amazing. Brilliant. Yeah. 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 We we actually got invited to South America with them oh, to do a wow. tour there, and we had to turn it down because we couldn't leave our day jobs. Other stuff got in yeah, the way. Yeah. I just lost my mum, so I didn't really want to leave my family. And I can understand. Yeah, that, we had a yeah. bit of a bit of a shit time because of that, but. Yeah. You That's got what I mean about this year, taking it up a step. You know, yeah. we want to we want to be out there, we want to be active all over again, and um, yeah, brilliant. A bit of a comeback for us, really. I think. I like I hope. Yeah, fingers crossed. No, yeah, it'll be fine. Crossed, it'll be yeah. fine. Um, and in terms of of Hard Rock Hour, any bands in particular that you're looking forward to seeing tonight, this weekend, or? I'm actually looking forward to seeing Skin Dread. I've never seen them live before, so I'm gonna definitely watch Skin Dread. Yeah. And whoever else we can we catch. We were fortunate to see him. Well, I was fortunate to see him in, on Thursday evening oh, on, the, on this, this tour yeah, in home for. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, for me, yeah, just, they're a great band to watch live. They, they deliver all the time. It's going to be nice to see the juxtaposition between us and, and then them straight after, yeah. you know, because yeah. we're, we're kind of sticking our nose in between a current touring, you know, touring package. Yeah, because it's Raging and uh, Yeah, yeah, and so Raging Speed on just before us and then us and then Skin Drift straight after. So it's yeah. going to be... Interesting. Yeah, very interesting, <laughs> I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but to be sharing the stage with them and everything yeah. is, is definitely a, a cool feeling. Um, HRH events previously, have you been to or gigged at yeah, these course, before? Yeah, we've done a few, yeah. Yeah, yeah? we've done a few. Um, done the Hammerfest thing. We did yeah. Hard Rock Hell a few times as well. And they're always great events to be at, aren't they? Yeah, well, Hammerfest last year was great. Yeah. I think yeah. it's because there's such a different myriad of bands playing on the same kind of genre for the other ones. Yeah. Uh, having a dedicated metal one, it brings everyone together. And yes. we're, we're fortunate to have some really, really, really good followers. Uh, we with the band that oh, yeah. quite die hard for us. So uh, even though we've been inactive for a few years, to, to say that we've come back and we're quite high up on such a bill, yeah, yeah. It's, uh, yeah, it's very humbling for us. Oh, that's brilliant. It's good to hear. Well, thank you very much for sitting in with us today. Thank you.